Hello. Shut the fuck up! No, dude! You just gonna I settle know. who that is? Really oh, just gonna you're just gonna unmute? You're just gonna step off. and talk over me like that, bro? Oh. Birds arrive. Really, bro? Thank you, I, uh, I appreciate that. Thank you so much. <clears throat> Ban you? No. Okay. Hello, Anna. Hello. Um, I'm probably gonna get the info from uh, Laura in about five minutes, but my file says deleted. Yeah, sorry, you're out of you, okay? Mm-hmm. Right. <laughs> By Laura knows. Is she gonna fill you in? Okay. No, no, I'm asking, is she gonna fill you in? I... Yeah, I hope. I told her to come to the U house. Talk oh. to me. Well, I see her. She's right in front of me. Truthfully, I am just second... I All I know is second hand information, so... And same as her, so... It'll just be like... Try and retell to the best of our abilities. Okay, been going through my, you know, phone book, trying to reach anybody. So, there's that. Yeah. That was okay. me yesterday. Okay, well, Laura just... Ah. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll have it. Oh. Hello. Hello. <clears throat> Hello. Oh. <clears throat> oh, fucking hell. Uh, I just woke up and I can barely speak, so. It's all uh, right. I can try and Laura, recount. So yeah, I can, I can try and recount events as much as I can, well, from what Patrick told me. But holy fuck. <laughs> Is what I can say. So, long the long story short version is, Makabi is no longer in Yokai, and officially got blooded out. And it started from something that was related to business, and then he made it a Yokai problem. And by Yokai problem, I mean sending very incriminating texts. Which resulted in the flooding out. That's the short version. The text included like it's talks um, about murder, talks about terrorism, yes. yeah. talks about basically what he did for her, what yeah, that's, he covered that's what up for her. Yeah, just literally yeah. spouted out through text. I did this for you. I did this for you. I covered for you during this. Kind of vibes, yeah. Was not, wasn't good. Wasn't a good look. So they had to like handle, handle the situation in a manner that you know obviously couldn't be traced back to them. Because in the text, you know, obviously like, yeah. Patrick told me the text that Mary said to meet him here. You know, he's handing his sword. So they had to handle it so that you know they didn't, they didn't kill him. They just like blooded him out. But he was very injured, and uh, yeah, they just kind of handled that. Okay, there is 
definitely stuff missing because why would he from a business issue turn to sending her that message via text? That's a good question. That is a really good question. <clears throat> Literally no one knows. That's the issue. We just it just, just went from zero to a hundred very quickly and no one really knew why. Like it went from oh he filled out some forms wrong at Mushkin's Motors and that turned into him quitting and then just shouting at Mary, I guess. Yeah, I don't know. It, it seemed like um he felt his loyalty was being questioned and so I don't know. I think yeah, the texts like were like stuff. Yeah, so I think like the texts were like, you know, you know telling Mary like all the stuff that he's done for her, you know. Okay, that still doesn't it doesn't make doesn't the whole story for me. doesn't make sense. It really doesn't. Like Patrick talked to me about this for an hour and a half yesterday, nearly two hours in the Okay, so know. anybody else would have had twenty minutes, I understand. Um, <laughs> he has had a short fuse in the past. Um, Several times, but from what I've heard. Stuff, stuff like that got resolved. I'm not quite sh Okay, so... Business stuff can always be, be handled. So I'm not sure if there was a... Back and forth that we're not privy to. Yeah, I mean, you all there's said, like... It's secondhand info. Yeah, like a lot of this stuff is secondhand. Even the people that were there that night, I don't know. It seems like parts of it are still secondhand. Because obviously, I mean, I don't, you know, I don't really know, like, what was exactly said between Mary and Okabe directly, you know? Like, there's, there's like, some very fine details that I still kind of would like. Because, you know, the the main takeaway from all of this was that everyone was very surprised and did not understand why Wakabi was acting that way. So for me, either, either there were some things that were said between the two of them that not everyone is aware of, or something else is going on, was going on with Wakabi that made him that, you know, basically made the guy have like a breakdown or whatever. <laughs> yeah, I feel like from what from what I was told, it might have been like a lot of stuff pent up over time and this was kind of the final straw for him that just kind of made him lash out and just kind of throw everything into the fire kind of thing. Okay. Uh while I don't want to start assuming stuff without having talked to Mary and Wakabi. Yeah. Uh to same. a certain degree. Uh what are the results out of this i'm imagining uh wakabi is out in the icu um karina is most likely out um because she's out because people she felt people were being distasteful about wakabi um and she didn't really want to be a part of it um Um, and then and Jasper a bunch and Mercy of, is out too. Yeah, Jasper and Mercy are out. Sean's probably out. I think Yuki's out. Um, Lisa on the fence. Okay. Um, I mean, three out of those four weren't even. Were they Mikomis yet? Yeah, they were Mikomis. Yes. Were Mikomis. Okay, for for a month, that that shows me or tells me a lot right now. Uh, Yuki, special story, anyways. Um, yeah, it's quite telling, if you ask me. And things become a little bit tough, emotional, drama. Uh, are they gonna leave uh, the ship right away? That's 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 strong. Good move. And they probably only have one side anyway, so yeah. good job. Like, Wakabi hasn't even woken up yet from what I can tell. I 
haven't heard anything about it. Yeah, no one's even talked to him. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so we he's got his side of the story yet. Yeah, he's in the ICU. Um, supposedly he's stable, but he's, you know, he's still unconscious. So. I'm just thinking. With this amount of willpower, maybe it's a good thing that they're out. Because, I don't know. I'm not sure I'd want to rely on people like that when the time comes. Well, that has me a little bit confused when it comes to Wakabi. Yeah. Always uh, put him confused. in the category of a true soldier. He might, uh, well, he, he was considered to be command at one point, uh, but with his actions, he kind of failed himself. So I'm not sure if that was a reason. I, I mean, one of, my t one of my takeaways that I mentioned last night, though, was like, I mean, Wakabi was like, the most loyal to Mary, like the most dedicated to the cause would do, you know, just about anything or if not actually anything. And I don't know my, one of my issues is that I feel like, you know, if I was that dedicated, if I, if I was that, you know, loyal and invaluable, I would, I would have hoped that perhaps Mary put in a bit more effort to prevent things from getting to the point where he's getting slashed across the back and flooded out. I mean, everyone says like, it's, you know, they were incredibly surprised by his behavior. And so I don't know, I, I would, I would question why is he acting like this? Is something going on, you know? And I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I don't like that. It got that far, you know? like should be able to like recognize that something must be going on for it for him to be acting in such an irrational way because on the surface right it, it's completely reasonable that mary's upset that he messed up a contract asked him to fix the contract you know so it's like what like why does he start acting like that i don't know just seems like something else must be going on or something i don't know because it doesn't really make sense when you lay out the facts like that. Like, there's something missing. Yeah. You could also say that the margin of insubordinance for some, from someone like him is way smaller than anyone else because of what he's done and what he knows and his history. If you want to flip it that way. Okay. Yeah, I'm I'm not going to start the guessing game. I know some facts that they've known each other for a long time. I know what he did for her, but it's not you know, when you're talking about people being loyal to Mary, he's not the only one in Yokai that is loyal or well, in his case was loyal to Mary. So like I said, I want to talk to the parties involved. If they want to talk to me about it before yeah. I'm gonna um, fill up the picture. Uh, what I. Wait, no, wait do I have three people? Regardless of <laughs> him being blooded out, the bigger <laughs> issue that I have <laughs> is uh, full members Thank you too, having huh? issues with the decision so Mary much. made. <laughs> that is my bigger issue that I have. <laughs> and frankly when it comes to the Mikomis there's reason why they're Mikomis and not full members yeah mm -hmm. what's your state ID by the way please 5734 yeah I fucking panicked yesterday because I wasn't in the dark I thought <coughs> I got kicked out for something there you go I woke up and I was like oh fuck what have I done yeah, no, Patrick's no, like, McCombs no, okay. are being Fine. added to the document for the time being. He's just so uh, Patrick uh, added me manually because um, I expressed to him, like, you know, severely that I'm not going anywhere. 
I don't plan on going anywhere. My loyalty stands. Yeah, I just know other ones because they're, they seem to be falling like flies, so... Yeah, people then we, like that way we'd have to make new a new document right away, which is really annoying. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, okay. A lot of work. A lot of uh, cleaning house to do, I guess. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Got to love that N.A. Kai. <laughs> We're all fucking asleep. Yeah, fucking... Yeah, um... <coughs> Patrick was telling me the story about it all because obviously I haven't been around as long as most of you have. Um, he was telling me like this isn't like the first time that that he's done something like this, or not like fully to this extent, but like times where he's kind of jumped the gun on a situation that wasn't that serious and just blew it out of proportion. Because like I think you mentioned something about him and JJ had a fight and then said something to Dragon along the lines of like I will not save you if you're in trouble kind of thing. Yeah, we heard that story as well. Some business yeah. discussions that didn't go very well, and it, Yokai Makabe problem. was taking it out on all of Seaside, basically, for yeah. something that has nothing to do with Seaside, right? <clears throat> exactly. Like more of a and personal that, issue, like making it a Yokai issue. Yeah, and, and I mean, I think the, the detail in that is not just all of Seaside, like, specifically telling Dragon, who's also Yokai, that he won't ever be helping him if yeah, he's being exactly. chased. Okay, I know the story behind that. Uh, it's a little bit more than what you are aware. Okay. Patrick, um, Patrick told it yesterday. I mean, yeah, but all Patrick said was that it was a business discussion. Mm -hmm. you, you wear what kind of business? I mean, yeah. Yes. I know what JJ deals in. Exactly what item, obviously, no, but does it really matter? No. I can just assume it's like disagreements about... Yeah, but you also need to see who are the Seaside members that he's quote-unquote closest to and is interacting the most. Who? Oh. Seaside is mostly these 12 hours. So if he gets to see somebody, it is JJ and Dragon. Now, do I uh, think it was stupid the way he handled things? Yes. But then again, you always go to those that you have a connection. I don't think he would go to Benji and have the same conversation or to whatever newest full member there is in Seaside that he doesn't know. We just also got told as well yesterday to like not really like obviously to not speak ill of of Akabi around you know like Yuki and a few others, but just in general because there was like issues with that as well. <coughs> like after the situation happened and people were just kind of talking about it so lightly, so uh, I don't know, just kind of speak ill of him, and then obviously it pissed a few people off, so. Barry told everyone to just not, just to not talk about it in that manner. I mean, realistically, who would want to talk ill of him? Like, exactly, he's a good guy. Like, I was really surprised about all this. Okay, he also fucked up. There's a reason why uh, he's in ICU now and not in Yokai anymore. So, so much for yeah, being exactly. a good guy. Yeah, he did go. He did go too far. Like the the text thing, I was really shocked about. Yeah, and that was like what he opened with in the arguments, yeah. and then they then they came here and from what Patrick and Dragon said, things really went out of hand. Like 
verbally between mm. them. Like shouting match kind of vibe just for a long time. Something along the lines of uh, not giving him like the respect or, you know, um, yeah, like the, she doesn't trust him enough to make like certain deals at Mushkins, so that must correlate to how much she trusts him with yokai and other stuff. I mean, if I'm reading the Discordia right, it was a lease to own contract. It yeah, basically, like bas money, yeah, right? basically, what happened is he sold a car to a friend, and um, Mary and Patrick weren't uh, around at the at the moment to to create the contract. So he sold the car to his friend, and his friend was going to sign the contract once the contract was available. Yeah, he signed over the ownership of the car before the contract was signed. And on top of that, he also did not um, charge interest in front of the car. So there was like $270,000 missing even from that, not just like the down payments or the payments strategy. Okay. The worst that thing like the that can happen issue. out of this is he needs to fork up the money if the guy runs without paying the well, the, lease well, the guy part. the guy did already sign the contract so you know from that perspective that his friend signed the contract as he said he would um so that's that's yeah i mean that part is is resolved already well <clears throat> according to patrick it's it's somewhat solved there's still like Hundred and twenty thousand dollars missing, basically. But, yeah, because yeah. of the interest. But yeah. Yeah, because. Uh, I guess Wakabi made some efforts to try and solve things, so he just like transferred hundred and fifty thousand dollars, and like the transaction notes said like, or the interest or whatever, something like something like that. I like, clearly annoyed, and um, it wasn't even enough. Like there was. He, he transferred 150. It was supposed to be 270 thousand. So like even now, there's technically still money missing. But Patrick said they're not gonna press that issue. Yeah, anymore. I don't think that money really Hello? will be the issue of all issues. Hey, hey, hey we're at the the house. Do you wanna come by? Yeah, I can come by. I just need to get food really quick because I'm gonna pass out otherwise yeah, yeah can you get some food for us too we're hungry can do thank you he has arrived giga chad the man of words the walking essay bible mouth If you want hyper details, Patrick will know. It kind of just like depends on how much you really like to get into it. It's like, like I said, it's really hard without being able to speak to either Mary or Okabe, I suppose. Yeah, I mean, honestly, from the discussion last night, I don't, I mean, I think what we covered basically covers it all. I mean, if you want to know, like, exactly the mean things they said to each other, you know, you can. You can ask them, but yeah, usually the that's... mean things happen after the the explosion, and I guess the explosion was uh, I deserve more loyalty from you, or I don't know. I don't. Yeah, I don't know. It was like, from my understanding, it was like it was like not that he like was demanding anything more. It was that he felt like. His loyalty was being questioned. I mean, yes. 
he gave a friend a car and lease to own before the contract was signed and no interest. So there is no loyalty to the company, which is an important part for Mary. At least over that friend. And he, and he felt like he felt like all she cared about was money. It's like like one of the things she said basically. I got business has simple guidelines. Well, if he can't follow a script, then I'm not sure uh, what else he can't follow. And then again, you're allowed to make mistakes. Mistakes happen. But you should be able to handle your failure and with grace at least and uh, <clears throat> do your best to rectify things. I don't know, to yeah, me it sounds like it this business thing was, it was just anything that set him off. If, if, if not this business thing, it would have been something else probably, from what I can understand. Like if this business thing never happened and everything went smoothly with this, it would be like something else further down the road that would have him react like this, I think. From the sounds of it anyway, because obviously like, Feeling like he's not owed much and that Mary only cares about money, all those like things like that. That's clearly something he's been thinking about for a while, not just like because he fucked up a contract. Uh, so, so if it wasn't this contract, it would have just happened at a later time, probably, maybe. That's what I think. Yeah, but again, we're not privy to what they have been talking about, what other things are happening in the background that they're involved with. Also, Wakabi is not in a gang anymore since he left NBC, so I'm not sure if he was putting a certain amount of energy into Yokai for him to build up something more gang related yokai again i'm assuming i'd rather not assume but hang on whoa fuck i'm so Ow! sorry i'm that. so sorry Did that. <laughs> i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry all right i'm on the way I'm sorry <laughs> you get free hit and you can get you can get a free hit in if you want no, how about you like, stop squaring up to me? Sorry. Free hit if you I will murder you in your sleep. I mean what? Whoa. <laughs> I guess did you know where I live, but you probably do. That live. sounded so fucking creepy. Do you probably know where I live? I don't know. I'll look it up. Oh god, no dragon is so weak. Poor oh guy. yeah, fucking stuff's finally moving along with business stuff. Hopefully it'll be open within a month. That's good. Yay. Yay. It's been like six months worth of waiting around for stuff to finally get started. And it's getting started. Where it's been work done, which is gigs. I need to think real hard for a minute. Careful with that. Thinking is dangerous. Hello. Hello. Morning. My voice hurts. <laughs> oh, 
Good morning. There's food in the fridge. Yep. One of these days, Sutler is going to come in here and actually. Oh, that's. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely yeah. wax or some shit. Ew, that slicks my teeth. Yeah. Have fun. Yeah. Have fun <sighs> brushing your teeth for the next two days with that feeling. That's going to. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Uh oh. You should. Oh no. You don't. You don't. Okay, I don't know how you get wax in your ears from eating. Okay, never mind. Ah, oh, so how much of this is your fault? Uh. You have to have a nap. It's wax fucked in my head. <laughs> If you can say that me having train issues with it breaking down over a period of 30 to 40 minutes He's is my fault, up. then it's my fault. He's getting ready. But after, after that, He's wrapping it up. Okay, give me the, the 15 minute TLDR, please. 15 minutes ex specifically? That's kind of hard, Hayes. I, I don't know how to hit 15 minutes. That's like. Yeah, that's. I gotta speedrun that shit. I mean, I could do you like a two-minute TLDR. Hold on, we need any months. I, I don't know how to hit 15. Okay. I won't be satisfied uh, after two minutes. Fuck that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um. So what do you know already? I know nothing, Patrick. That's why uh, I'm giving you uh, full reign. Well, full reign, I can talk for like 40 minutes. This is probably, probably about an hour. I talked to Lara for about he's an hour. He's ramping up to... big rack, and when he's full speed, uh, hyper rack. <laughs> okay, so elevator music yesterday, or not yesterday, two days ago. We can get some elevator music. Uh, Wakabi got a sale for one of the Sultan V8s, and he wanted the person wanted to do Lee Stone. So we set up the con or he asked me to come around to set the contract up with him or give him the contract so that he can set it up. I'm sure you can read that in the email. I mean, you probably did read it when it was happening. Bit loud. Yes, I know. Give me like a second. I said, I bet I emailed him directly and I said, all right, I'm, I'm coming. I've got the silver ticket. I'll be there soon. Just, you know, wait, wait for me. And then, like I said, train was being an asshole to me, kept breaking down. Uh, their ra the radio was broken, couldn't listen to any of the music, whatever. A lot of bullshit. Took me like an hour to get into the city. <laughs> uh, and maybe five minutes before I woke up, I got an email from Wakabi saying that uh, he had transferred the car, he'd gotten half the money, and all you have to do is call the guy to uh, set the contract up. And I was like, uh, that's not good. Okay, let me wake up and call this guy very quickly. I woke up, tried to call the guy, call, guy didn't answer. Uh, basically, it came to be that I, I tried to call the guy. Uh, I told Wakabi, you have to get this guy to sign the contract. Uh, Yo, are doing awake? Yo, no. we're at the house. Anyone awake that hasn't heard anything? <laughs> Hayes. I'm telling Hayes now. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Hold on. I got this, guys. I got this. Give me one moment. Uh, I, I feel for Dragon. <laughs> uh, so I, I told Wakabi, you have to get this shit signed. There's not really, like, a good option for this. <laughs> Call him. 
email him, whatever you've got to do, get this guy back around. He has to sign this contract. Uh, long story short, Mary was doing payroll. Uh, she saw the money came into the account. She saw the tracker and saw that there was no interest on it. She called Wakabi. Wakabi lied to her about the contract being signed. Mary called him out on the contract on him lying about it. Told him he has 24 hours to fix the contract and get it signed. And instead of do it, taking those 24 hours, he, in the next like 30 minutes, put in the email chain that he was going to quit. He's going to put his two weeks in. And uh, me and Mary both were trying to reach out to him to get eight. For me, I wanted to get the contract. Hold For on. Mary, Mary was like, are you crazy? Why are you quitting? Uh, and Wakabi blew up on her in text. He, 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 wouldn't, he wouldn't answer her phone calls. Uh, blew up on her in text. Sent her a bunch of crazy shit. Uh, saying that he's killed people for her. Fucking stopped her from doing... Like, like saved her from terrorism and shit. Um, and who who all else knows like what other you know incriminating shit was put in her phone like directly saying like you you wanted me to do this or I did this Oops. for you, you know that kind of thing. Uh, so obviously Mary's pissed. You know why in the fuck no. is Wakabi freaking out? Why is he putting all this crazy shit in her phone? Uh, she asks him to bring her uh, bring her the sword. I don't know if there was a time frame for the sword, but all I know is that she wanted the sword. <laughs> and, you know, Mary's done this before. Well, she'll take it, whether it's temporary or not. And it's a lesson to be learned because people are fucking up. You know, this happened to Violet. Um, from what I understand, Wakabi said, all right, I'll be there soon. So Mary got Dragon and Violet, and I was at the house already. And uh, Wakabi came in and they had a they had a back and forth. Um, <clears throat> there was yelling. There was some nasty things said on both sides. Um, Mary had given him the opportunity multiple times in the conversation to back down and say, hey, I'm sorry, there's something else like, you know, this wasn't like this was supposed to be just a business problem. That he took as a, in the best way that I can understand it, he took it as a loyalty test or a loyalty check. As in, Mary would not trust <laughs> him enough to, like, know that this guy that he gave the car to would sign the contract after the fact. Which, you know, to his, to to the guy to the customer's credit, he did. But, you know, that's not how Mary's ever done business. That Wakabi should know that's not how Mary's ever done business. Wait. Maybe and, have more. you know, obviously she was going to be pissed about it. And instead of wanting to fix that, you know, Wakabi just wanted to quit. So. Uh, they went back and forth. Uh, he, Wakabi said some really wild things that I wish I could remember in detail. But it essentially boiled down to. Um, Let's see. Uh, you don't trust me. You've never trusted, like, you, you've you never, like, respected my loyalty. My loyalty's never been uh, repaid or, like, recognized in any meaningful ways. Um, Maybe I can add you guys here, You don't too. care about anybody else besides yourself. You only care about money. You put yourself on a pedestal. Nobody, like, you've never done anything for me or the things that I've done for you don't matter to you. Um, you've gotten weak ever since you've turned yourself in. You've gotten lazy. You can sit in the... Um, what is that in the back here? And... You guys can sit here. Over a period of like 30, 45 minutes, That's something like that, it got to a point where he was basically just telling her, if you can't trust me, then I want you to kill me. I want you to put me six feet under. And that was basically a five-minute thing where... Everything that Mary said to him, he would respond with, well, then you should just put me six feet under. Well, you know, like back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. Just him throwing shit back in her face and then Mary responding and saying, well, you should just, if you don't, then you should just kill me. And eventually, uh, Mary took his sword, had him turn around, and she put two crosses uh, uh, across his back and put him out of the crew. 
we took him on the outskirts of the city and called EMS for him. And I got a response from the EMS that they were on their way. And we left it at that. We left him there. And that was it. Okay. Yeah. Was that 15 minutes? No, I have no idea, but it's, no, it's okay. You I feel satisfied, Patrick. It's good. Okay. <laughs> Did well. Yeah. Okay. So he was doom spiraling out of uh, the contract stuff. Okay. The the best TLDR that I've been able to cook up is he got called out for trying to lie to Mary about making a business mistake. And instead of just correcting that business mistake and learning from it and growing from it, he popped off. He popped off and turned it into something way bigger and went from a business thing to a personal thing to a crew thing. In the span of about an hour. What did Wakabi and lie about? He told Mary that he had the contract signed. And then she asked mm. him what the interest was. Okay. And he waffled. And didn't like have the exact numbers. And like. Because if you, if you write the contract correctly. You know how much they pay back. Over a period of 10 weeks. How much they're supposed to pay. And he didn't know what the, he didn't know what the numbers were. Basically. Because he, he didn't put interest on the, on the lease to own. He just sold the he just sold the car to the guy outright for two point seven. There was nothing on top, so he he didn't have the numbers to actually like fake it, which is the other problem. But you know, in the grand scheme of things, it's fucking it, literally the entire contract thing is like small potatoes at this point. Who's but yeah, he, he he got called out, and instead of fixing it, he just fucking up and quit, and freaked out after that. Who's the guy that bought the car? Uh, Reese Leclerc. He's a sol solid enough dude, and he did sign the contract. I had to wake up and write a whole new contract and get him to sign it because Wakabi repaired to refused to give it to me. Um, but you know, to to Reese's credit, he did sign the fucking thing. But that wasn't the issue. <laughs> it was Wakabi refusing to. Sorry, that's the, even the, the try Ross to get guy. it done. That was it. Reese Leclerc. Uh, Reese. Okay, I have no idea. Yeah, Reese. Reese yeah. <clears throat> Where's the harmony? I think. Yeah. Every time Rod sees him, he says that he's an undercover cop. But I don't know. Conspiracy theories. Yeah. What other questions you got? None really. I I want to talk to the actual parties involved uh i told them already the biggest issue i have is with Hello. what comes from this Morning. hi oh my god um hey, Jay. those mikomis and full members that have issues with mary's decision that's that's more the problem that i have yeah oh yeah that's that's the surprising thing i expected maybe one or two people to you know, waffle and not want to keep going through it. Um, I'm definitely surprised. There, there are some people I'm surprised by, though. Hi, Jace. You've missed out. Hello. You, you just missed story time. Oh. I'm happy to hear story uh, time again. Well, this is going to yeah. be the two-minute version because <laughs> I really don't want to tell this story five times today. <laughs> Um, okay, Jace. So just to basically tell you the short version, Wakabi is no longer a part of the crew. Huh? Wakabi is no longer a part of the crew. He okay. asked... What? Him and Mary had a disagreement when it came to something to do with Mushkins. Wakabi made a mistake. Mary asked him to fix it. Instead of fixing it, Wakabi decided to quit. When Mary challenged him on why he quit, he told he sent her a bunch of incriminating text messages in her phone, uh, saying like basically tying her to a bunch of uh, shit that we've done in the past. You know, any number of things that you can imagine that Wakabi's done for Mary. It was, it's not very good. So obviously Mary freaked out. She wasn't very happy. Uh, they came to the house. They had a meeting together where it basically became a, a back and forth. Neither side was happy. 
and Wakabi asked to be killed. And instead of killing him, Mary let him uh, cut him across the back, and we s left him for EMS to find on the outskirts of the city. And he is no longer a part of the crew. Oh, uh, that's the last person I expected to not to, <laughs> yes. to, to go. You could have told me anybody else, and I, I would believe you, but for Wakabi to even yell at Mary is like a 180 of his, Imagine being of who he is. You're just like, me. but I mean, we're, we're, we're all surprised. <laughs> I mean, from, like, what I've seen and spoken and heard, like, you know, when... Like, I don't even know. I'm, that, fuck. Yeah. There's, uh, I mean, there's obviously more to it. Uh, there was some nasty shit said. Wakabi really... I, I listened to most of it. Uh, Wakabi took me by surprise. Uh... Never expected him to say half the shit that he did. The He basically wanted... He felt like he wasn't getting recognition for everything that he's done for the crew, and that his loyalty was never repaid or respected for everything that he's done for Mary. And took Mary having a very business-focused mindset about, like, when you do business things with Mary... You do it correctly. You do it from step one to two, uh, step one to two to three to four. You don't jump corners. You don't skip steps. You do it a certain way because that's how you save yourself. You know, save your own ass. And Wait, Wakabi skipped steps, and then when we he was told to fix them, he quit instead. So this happened because he fucked up somewhere in business. And it somehow... He made a business mistake, and Mary told him to fix it. He quit instead, and then blew up on Mary in her phone, in uh, in text messages, and turned it into a wildly different thing. Get spawn kills. Bad luck, Hayes. Yeah. <laughs> Should have a better hard drive, so you don't. Skill issue. Yeah. But the two. What? What do those lines even cross? Uh, I don't know. That's a question for Wakabi, unfortunately, because the the to the best of my understanding, he took Mary, saying you have twenty four hours to fix this contract, uh, or you're liable for the money, as no Mary not trusting him to get the issue resolved, an issue that he created, by the way, which is important. Because he had, it's not like he just did it out of the blue, or he he knows how to do this. He in, he intentionally did not wait for me to come around to help him with the contract. Um, <laughs> and for whatever reason, he took that he she does not trust me to the furthest extremes it could go, and turned it from a business thing, which is all it was ever going to be. Because I have made many business mistakes with Mary, and all I've ever had to do was say, I am sorry, I will fix this, and I will do better in the future. And I am still, to this day, in my positions, sure, if you doing everything the, that I need to do and want to do. The GIF. You know? Uh, the, the jump, the jump in logic, the jump of from personal, or from business to personal, it, it was made in Wakabi's mind, and basically forced Mary's hand in responding to Wakabi in kind. Because otherwise, she has to back down as a, as a leader of the crew because it it was turned into a you-don't-trust-my-loyalty thing. And... It's... Wakabi is very sensitive when it comes to him thinking someone questions his loyalty, to be fair. I remember well, yeah, I mean, guys, there's... Uh, hello. I remember when he shot Marcus <laughs> because Marcus was Morning. joking at him about something and he turned it into a you're questioning my loyalty and then shot him so yeah he, 
that's like the one thing I think is extremely discord emo isn't enough fragile. It's just that I have to convert him, everything that he, from web p web p to I guess from what you've just told me, even if, if someone could do that, even if it's not been hinted, even if he just suspects or feels like something's being questioned, he seems to just people meltdown. People yeah, meltdown. I mean. <sighs> I would hope that it's more than that, because if that's all that it was that triggered it, then that's just kind of... Hold on, guys. It's not... For the thing, Jace, for e for everything that I want to be in this crew, it was a picture-perfect copy of Wakabi. How people view him, how people, like, respect him, like, out in the feet, like, out when we're doing shit fucking like I, I want to have is a dependable reputation as wakabi is I'll put there. the microwave right here for everything that i aspire to be in this crew and how much of a role model wakabi was for me everything that i heard him say i i hope to god it was not just because he's a, he's sensitive about his loyalties being questioned because if so i can i genuinely can never respect the man the same way that i used to and that it was my like what a complete 180 of his character and the things that he was saying to Mary just fucking just off the wall crazy shit. So I, I genuinely hope it's more than that. I hope there is some <laughs> deeply rooted issue that he's had for months now that he's never expressed to anybody that just fucking bubbled to the surface and exploded. Because at least then I can understand why he went to such extremes. But. I mean, he is he is a bloke, and unfortunately, blokes don't really uh, express their emotions. We usually like to um, internalize it and internalize, it, and eventually, it's like a when you shake up a can of coke or a bottle of coke or something. Eventually, it's just gonna, you know, explode. And I guess, I guess that's what yeah. happened. Yeah, I just it. I don't know it. It's messy, Jace. And the, the thing that you walked in on us talking about is figuring out uh, so other people are leaving. Mary basically. dancing on the microwave. <laughs> oh. Uh, we have... We know Jasper and Mercy are gone as Makomi. The, nothing nothing was done, obviously. Nobody gives a fuck. He was barely um, even Makomi <laughs> to begin with. Hey, are they gone? Yeah. Both of them? Yeah. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> That's unfortunate. How big yeah, should she I, be? Uh, there's, I mean, there's some more shit going on. There's a narrative going around that, <laughs> that it's fucking dumb. Uh, Karina and Yuki are very much on the fence. Um, I don't. Uh, I Marcus is probably gone, although he hasn't said one way or another. Um, Sean. Go. Sean's a maybe. Uh, I mean, Marcus he's very on? close to. Uh, well, we tried to start explaining everything to him, and he heard he was in the ICU, because Wakabi is in the ICU at the moment. He is stable, to my best understanding. Um, <laughs> you know, it's not dead. Uh, he heard that Wakabi was in the ICU, and he heard that he was cut out of the group, and. I did not get any further explaining anything else before Marcus walked away. So I, I don't I genuinely don't know. Hold on, okay. I don't get that guy sometimes. Well, I mean, isn't isn't Marcus's brother? Yeah, they're they're Wakabi and yeah. Marcus are close. Uh, so I mean they're I would close not one be day surprised. and then they're trying to fucking murder each other the next. It's hard to tell with them too. That's how it is with the brothers. Speaking from experience. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's um, true. I mean, you and Rico. Mm-hmm. But yeah, uh, <laughs> Karina and Yuki and Marcus, all full members, maybe leaving. Mm -hmm. And Jasper and Mercy and maybe Sean. <laughs> so. I don't well. think there's anybody else that's on the fence. Everybody else is more or less understood. Everybody, even in the moment, uh, like immediately afterwards, we're all kind of just like, that wasn't Wakabi, something else is going on, fucking yada yada. 
What a masterpiece. Yeah. It's a masterpiece. It, it's, it's a lot. <laughs> When did Mercy uh, say was she's there... leaving? Sorry. Last night. Oh. Because I was, I was talking with her before that, I guess. I think it yeah. was before that. Yeah, she sent me a text uh, early in the morning saying that she was packing up and leaving. And then three hours later, she said that she talked to you and that she was going to decide to stick around and stay. And then a few hours after that, um, I heard from Jasper that her and Mercy both were leaving. So okay. she flip flopped three Sounds... or four times in the span of a day. Sounds like there was a lot of spiral in between those messages then. Yeah, well, there, there's another thing where Yuki and Karina are sharing this narrative that Dragon and Violet were like, or not even just Dragon and Violet, that the round table around the pool table upstairs were laughing and making jokes about Wakabi after the fact when that was not the case at all. And that's got that's what some I heard as well. Uh, it's there was a there was a moment where Rami made a joke about that Wakabi guy, right? Am I right or whatever like middle school shit that he can come up with off the top of his head? Like a fucking and... Seinfeld joke, you know? It's like a Haha. yeah, Haha. Okay. yeah. It's, it, it's a lot. It's a mood lightener. It's literally it's we've been sitting here doom spiraling for two hours. Let's lighten the mood a little bit. You know, it, it didn't turn into a twenty minute. You know, like improv session or anything it's fucking it was that and then the conversation came up about dragon being promoted and violet said that's my makomi and somehow that's been twisted into violet and dragon being proud about uh dragon being promoted with wakabi sword and like reveling in it for some reason like i i don't know there's there's a narrative spin going on the rumor mill is spun up on the on, a, on this other side quote unquote and it's pissing me off but unfortunately, I, I don't think I have the energy to care anymore. So if people want to leave because they heard the wrong thing, then fucking whatever. I mean, if they don't care enough to get the other side of the story, then what, what can you do? They've already made them Yeah. Work well, that, that's the craziest thing is, is the people who are talking about this have the entire story, but they're still talking about it as if they just want to see the worst in people, which I guess is their choice. Again, who is the one... You said Karina and Yuki are stirring. Uh, I would say it's probably Yuki because Yuki's done this to me in the past. Uh, but to his credit, I don't really know. I'm just assuming. But I, I'm planning on talking to him about it. Uh, eventually, because yeah, I, I'd be a He's hypocrite. He's gonna if catch I'd... a bullet if he keeps it up. Yeah. Well, I mean, I fucking well, I, I I'll be honest. I heard a lot of crazy shit yesterday. I was talking to Jasper about uh, we spent about an hour on the phone after everything because ja when Jasper Jasper quit, he told Mary that this life isn't for me. I just I I I don't know why it took me this long, but I realized I'm never I've never been about a racing crew or a gang or anything. This isn't what I want to do. I just want to I just want to live a simple life. Is what he told Mary. Mary told him to get out of the house, and afterwards, he tells me that, you know, there's all that shit, like, I, I don't believe that. I'm gonna be honest with you. I love Jasper, I don't believe it, because he's he told me afterwards on the phone that if he was in the room, he would have tried to stop Mary, even to the point that he would have tackled her and tried to take the sword out of her hand before it happened. And, and the, to me... Gone slice too. Yeah, that's not a simple life kind of living man. That's a you don't want anything to happen to a copy kind of person like you know i i and i love the dude and i respect him for like having that opinion but that's just how two people fucking end up dying or getting hurt or fucking you know that it's just it's not gonna it doesn't solve anything well it would have been but, easier for him to stop uh wakabi from doom spiraling instead of then saying he would have stopped mary yeah yeah, I don't know. It's just, uh... <sighs> yeah, it's messy. I need high command talked about it. Or do they even know? Uh, Izzy and Cass know. I don't know if Finley's been awake to find out yet. Uh, Mayumi knows. Chad, I just she realized... was there the night of afterwards. 
I'm not sure if Fiona knows, oh, and obviously Mary didn't realize anything. Evolved, so. I'm stupid as hell. Uh, I'm not sure if green? Alex knows. There might be a sick. Uh, but I'm assuming she'll find out from Mary eventually. Maybe they ate something, ate something bad. Uh, but most full members have been told and talked about so far, I think. I think. Jace, you and Jace were some of the, the last ones on the list. Uh, that explains why the uh, the Majiggy's gone. Cause I, was gone right? I woke up earlier yeah. and no one was around Fucking and I had no way of contact with people. You no, on yeah, we're, we should be putting much. the radio on the fridge for the time that. being. Um... So much we're we're minutes. adding people to the new doc slowly <laughs> because we if you're if you want it uh, so the 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 capstone to this whole thing is you're free to make your own decision. Obviously, if you want to go talk to Wakabi and get his side of the story, you're you can. Uh, if you want to be friends with Wakabi after this, you can. Nobody's going to be upset with anybody about you know keeping friendships going. But when it comes to crew business, it's crew business now. Wakabi's not a part of it. That makes um, sense. I mean, I have no intention of leaving, so. Well, that's that's all people, we care about. You know, if, if you want to keep time. going, then, yeah. Unfortunately, that's just uh, how life is. People, people come yeah. and go, but I have no intention of going anywhere because this is literally all I have. Well, then, there is the new document. Uh, but yeah, yeah so... No, no, yeah, you've already got it. I just, I ha I've written down everyone's state IDs because it's just going to make this whole process easier. The only full members that don't know still are Wayne, Danny, Terry, and I don't know if JJ knows, but JJ will know when he talks to Cass, uh, and then Summer, obviously. Uh, there's a couple of Makomi that still don't know. I don't know if TJ knows, although Chip has been talked to. I don't know if Kate knows. I haven't seen Kate in a few days. I don't know about Ledson or Shano or Omar or Dick. Like, there's a there's a lot more Makomi that don't know, but yeah. I mean, the people that are left, I don't see leaving. When needed, but I mean, I'd, yeah, I'd rather full members know because it's... recap stream. For members who aren't yeah, awake. I mean, not, I'm not devaluing the Makomi, but I'm just saying like... And I'm finding ways to entertain myself. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Nico, Nico also left, although it had nothing to do with the Wakabi stuff, to my understanding. <laughs> um, He's the de facto leader of the HOA now, so he's focusing on that rather than joining a racing crew. Yeah, that's understandable. I mean, that's probably at that point. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. Well, shit. Yeah, yeah, no, it's, uh, this has been, this has been life for the last 36 hours. Good thing I've delayed hosting that yokai tournament, then. <laughs> Poor Dragon, uh, Patrick, dude. They talked so much yesterday, probably. Yeah, any questions? Anything that I can help explain, or anything that you're curious about that I can further... Like go into more detail. You you got the really short version, Jace. But it, the the bare facts of it is that. Yeah, it feels it feels like cliff note, but I get it. I think I think you've laid down what's important and what what's happens. Kind of fucking rough. Yeah. Well, that fucking sucks. Yeah, the only thing to do besides keep talking to the members that don't know yet is. You know, if you're deciding that you're staying, if you want to talk to Mary, if you want to talk to Violet, you know, if you want to talk to Wakabi even to get his side of it, to see what's going on, that's the only thing that most of us care about. Like, nobody in the room was happy to have any of that shit happening. Nobody was pleased with it. Nobody's fucking... Uh, nobody's satisfied. We all want to know why in the fuck Wakabi fucking popped off. Like, if the guy had more issues than he was letting on to everybody before then, you know hopefully we can find out why because maybe it can 
Patrick's superpower yeah. has really come into. I've got a lot. Of, I've got a lot of things this. about how I feel about that guy right now, but it's it, yeah, it's a lot. <laughs> Otherwise, all we can do is really move, pick up, and move on, and you know, a little bit of spring cleaning with other members that weren't for the crew, but just for the people in the crew. Which sucks, but it is what it is. Rather, rather now than like them hesitating in a crucial moment later. Yeah, like if this came to if this came to blows outside of the house or in like a big situation or uh where shit's actually on the line, then yeah, it better now. Can we make her big? And what if She's just behind the couch here, dancing. <laughs> oh my god. Can I ask a question while I'm here? Yeah. So, this is just about like racing stuff. Um, I was going to set up a race this morning um, for someone who... I don't know what the rules are about using yokai tracks if you're not yokai, like as in making a race. Because um, I forgot what she's called. Uh, she works at Uru. Um something I forgot, I forgot. akari akari yeah she was um she was making races under yokai um yeah so obviously it's you know i i wouldn't do that you, you know, can I was, make you, just kind of as you can use the track but not as yokai in a title yeah she had it in the title kind of thing she's mm -hmm. either she only called it like yotoke but still like oh let me ask, insinuating that's, that's that that's well, yeah, yes. I mean, that's the name like, oh, the, the track's yeah. name is yeah. Yokai Toad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just... But you know, obviously, told him to be a bit careful about it. Obviously, as long as you don't put Yokai in the name. Yeah. Yeah. Akari... Really not... yeah. As long as you don't say that it's a Yokai race, you can still, you know, if a track is called Yokai Toad or Yoto, whatever. I mean, that's fine. But yeah, just yeah, yeah. Make sure people don't fuck about with tracks like Hiyaki Yagio. Yeah, 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 the only track yeah. that we care about is Hiyaki Yagio. Everything else is free game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, well, not pop uh, PM initiation, but yeah, I don't even. Yeah, is that track yeah, even there? Yeah. Still. Yeah, it is. Oh, it is. Oh, okay. Damn, that's the the purge somehow. Yeah, I thought I thought multi race got yeeted, didn't it? What? Multi race? No, 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 no. Multi race is there. It's there. I thought it got yeeted <sighs> though. It did, and it's back. Oh, good. Oh. Good. Why? Well, why are you celebrating that it's back? No one runs that shit, do they? Uh, every time I do a one we run against somebody, I do that race. Because uh, you're an asshole. No, because I, I prefer, you know, racing where people go and actually have to worry about crashing their car. How did BBD yeah. Breeze survive? You know what fucking... The two, there's two tracks that I'm upset about. Fucking Heat Sink and Devil's Gambit. Why in the fuck hey, are Gambit's those gone? Guys? Why is Gambit yeah. gone? That track got oh, ran literally every know. fucking day. That was a banger. Well, it wasn't every day, but it got ran. Yeah, it got ran very frequently. It's probably one of the uh, most frequent tracks ran. <sighs> it's fine. People will come up with new race, new, new races. Yeah, that's not. Well, that's that's why I'm not actually pissed because we can come up with new tracks with like similar ideas in mind. But it just it sucks. I like those tracks, man. Thanks, man. You know, there's no use crying over spilled milk, but damn it. I'd be sad about it. Don't worry. Somehow, best. Final Destination survived. <laughs> yeah, as well. Is Dueling um, Dragon still here? Bro, how about... Look, we all know the best track is still up, though. Broke Yellow. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Broke Yellow. Swear to God. It's the dumbest thing. <laughs> Not the dumbest thing, but it is one of the dumbest things she's ever done. Somehow rag, rag, rags and director's cut are still in. I guess those are just oh, like, like they're yeah, never those, going away. Those are like baby, you know, those are like training wheel tracks. Those are good to like. Oh fuck, director's yeah. cut! You start, you start your racing. You know, you start your your time in racing. You know, you run some of the classics. You know, yeah, yeah. yeah Maybe yeah, chat wants some tea. And, uh, that shit. Yeah, run rags. I need to practice. Hold like, on, a bit I got, I got you. Four haze. Here you go. Yeah. Man, this man ran by Mugtog every single day, and now it's, now it's gone. It's the best way for me to test cars and get into things. Well, now you can do Spirit Valley. That's definitely yeah, not Spirit the same Valley's thing. 
It's it's not the same thing, but it's got a is it's got as many long straights and hilly sections as you need it to have. Right. Yeah, you, listen. I mean, if you want a, a track with long straights, just wait till rather than make their new track. Okay, don't worry. No, he he, he liked he liked Vinewood Toad because it's a you get a good section of everything. Like it, it's it's good to know where your car is going to spin on a bump or a certain turn, or that's that was the that was the like the benchmark track for him. Yep. Marlo should host, host a million dollar race with no facing or broke your alert just to see the mold. Just do like Redline Toad. Mm. Redline Toad. That's got some. It that's just got some funky straight lines. Straight across Route 68 and back through Route 68. I'll do a track like that actually. You do a. You could just make a red line, red line, and it would literally just be Great Ocean Highway onto Del Perro, onto Las Santas Freeway, onto, Del, onto Great Ocean Highway. I thought we already had a track like that. I thought that was uh, Harmony just, 8. Just, yeah. Yeah, just call it red line and just have it do loops around the entire island on the highway. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So you don't have you always the red line. be in red line, yeah. <laughs> or just the red line. <laughs> you know what? I've just gotten the, the whole point of that name now. It's, it's taken me over like two years to figure that out. <laughs> I would not be Are talking you saying... about that if I were to. <laughs> wow. I would just like It's taken me two fig two years to figure figure out what red line meant. Well, you see, Jace, cars have these. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. It took me two years, but I got it. <laughs> Look, when you're driving okay, let me four... let me let me test something jace how many pistons does a rotary engine have i don't fucking know i don't drive rotary <laughs> oh no oh no oh no i know why jace didn't get that thing about red line he never hits the red line in his car you're a dude shut the fuck up <laughs> well probably henry doesn't know either about the rotary engine what, me? About rotary? Yes, I do. Uh-huh. I was thinking about buying it, but I don't feel like rebuilding the engine every, like, 30,000 kilometers. It's called a Dorito. The Dorito engine with the Apex seals. Oh, what? What? <clears throat> well, well, heard... It's called a Dor Dorito engine. Hey, so I've heard I've that heard the uh, AMG A45 is in stock. The Chavmobile. You can yeah, just buy James Bond's. Uh... Yeah, but he's going to charge like 5 mil. I mean, he's no. not going to charge 5 mil if there's one in stock. If he wants to sell it, he'll have to beat the price. Uh, Yeah, I mean, yeah, we're selling it for cheaper than 5 mil. How much is it? Uh... Mary yeah, bumped the price me. last night, so it's two point nine after tax, yeah, sixty three hundred. Getting out of the room because oh he's my ask for gosh! Money. I'm not. I, when have yeah. I ever asked I you don't... for money, Hayes? When have I ever asked for money <laughs> from anyone? I never ask for money. I just suffer. To your credit, I asked Hayes for your loan when you got the GTR. That you didn't ask. You didn't Hayes, want it. You almost, you almost uh, vehemently denied almost, it. It's like almost yeah. four mil. That's a lot. Fuck. Yeah. I never I mean, it's ask cheaper I than never, moldings. I legit never ask anyone for money. I hate doing that. It's like the worst feeling in the world. Yeah. If listen, if you want a four door fucking six star Schwarzer or a five a five seater S class six star Schwarzer, good car. I think you, I think you missed. Uh, somebody one. was calling <laughs> me about that yesterday. I didn't save their number that they want one, and I was like, yeah, I'm not gonna be around enough to get, to let you know. I think you're missing the point. Oh, why, I mean, we have one, three of them at stock at the, the team. Well, listen, oh. Mister Picky Hatchback. I, 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 I'm just telling yeah. you, if you want a five seater S class, I don't care about five seaters. I'm option. British. I want a hatchback. Fair enough. Get an Asbo. Yeah, then drive the Asbo. I would drive that. You guys know I would. Don't. Yeah. <laughs> don't. I will. I will do that. Is the A45 the only S-Class hatch hatchback now? Yeah. Ye Ever since it yes. took away my Yoka, so those motherfuckers. Oh, 
was whipping that thing around like like crazy as well. I miss it. Uh, I mean, unless you count the Kanjo SJ, but that's hardly a B class even. So Kanjo SJ, something I wouldn't even call it a hatchback. Yeah, it's not a hatchback. Mm, it is. Well, it's like you know, it does remind me of the old. Uh, it does remind me of like the old uh, Honda Civics that we used to have back in England. When they were all like boxy, because back like, in early two thousands, you had like the Vauxhall, mm, the, yeah, yes. the Vauxhall Astra and shit, which all had this same body type of these like long boxier kind of cars, and then everything went rounded and like everything got pugified and got like squished and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fucking, I kind of want to get out and do something. Y'all want to go do race? Yeah, can do. I have asset right. peach too. I, I don't know what Boy. I'm doing. Wait, does, does that mean you have to go make money, or does that mean that you can't pull your car out? I have money, but it's just I, I need to know. I, I don't know if I'm going to commit to being around like frequently. It's okay, I save them I, all for, for like, next time. Two races. I'm paying thirty k for two <laughs> races. It hurts. I'll just. I, I don't know. I'll just. I'll just ride with Henry. I'll be his passenger princess. Alright. Wake up. Uh, Let's put a... Yeah, I disagree. Oh. <laughs> or, you, or you can I rent a car. Stuff first. You can rent probably, a car. probably more than my asset fees. Uh, I said, no. like, drop the prices. No. Actually, I need to get my car up for rental. Is, is there a sex up and running yet, Hayes? <sighs> Talk to Violet. Talk to Redline. I don't see Violet around. Food in the fridge. Can't hit them when they're in the ground, bro. Leave the... Leave the fucking... NPCs alone. The NPCs? Yeah, you got NPCs no... for a while there. Why would I say that? I don't know, just NPCs, NPCs, kind of like same tone. Yeah, why would you say that? I don't know. Who's hosting? Uh, you or I. I don't matter which. I don't mind. I gotta go get my dog. Fine. Pick up some plates if anyone needs any. No. Uh, if you want to pick me two up, I'll send you the genie. I'm gonna make it private. Up to you. I don't really mind. Well, they're doing hidden gems, which is through the city, right? So I should be careful. Is it real? By the time everyone's ready, that race is gonna be over. Yeah. I'll host a little, a little classic mockingbird, and then we can pick whatever else after. I'm gonna put it up right now. Do we up? Right. Get the gas 
up and get a repair kit, and I'll be there. I called Dragon as well, because <laughs> Dragon said he wanted to race last night. Yeah, poor guy. Can you do my car too? Um, if I remember... Yeah, I think I can. That was a good talk. <laughs> I know how to entertain myself during long talks now. Sierra, please. Sierra, please wait. You stopped right in the middle of the road, like for no reason. <laughs> there was a car coming full speed ahead. Going to Alta or Red Garage? Yeah, I can go to Alta. Alta, because we're not pussies. <clears throat> I might actually get myself some chili cheese nuggets after stream today. Very soon. Hello. Yeah. Yeah. You got a lot of for me, or anybody wants to pick me up one for them? Laura was picking some up. Yeah, I got some. I have one that's about to go bad, so I'd rather you take that. And then I can just. Yeah, just take mine, that's bad. I'm here at the start, but I'm gonna think about something in my car for a sec while we're waiting for people. Two cheese nuggets? I make them myself. I just buy like a bag of them and then I, uh. Yeah, just buy a bag of them and then I, uh, nom them after heating them up. I put them in the oven for about 10 minutes until like the cheese starts like leaking. I have plates if anyone needs. Take mine, that's about to break. I am so stressed. 
Frank. Frank. Does yes. anybody have any marriage hucha? No. Can I get a bit? One Can second. I get a hit, please? Thank you. I see. Sorry, I'm not trying to look in your boot. Thank you. Yep, that's not good shit. Do you have any at the big place? Anybody? Yeah. Oh, thanks. I'm always looking for song, song suggestions. Um, I did see you post it, I just haven't checked them out yet because I'm uh, slow, but I will. Who's MDB? That will be me. I thought so. Alright, I hit the spot, thank you. There's no reason why I chose three random random letters. Oh my god, guys, do you see this bush right here? Yeah. It's growing kinda mad, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, pretty 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 mad. I don't have a radio yeah. by the way, so I'm just I'm I'm not picking up anything you guys are playing there. Oh, you're riding past. Okay, you. everyone's paying me, so just pay me now. Otherwise, I'm not gonna be able to keep track. Walk away, there you walk go. Away, walk away. Thank you. Why did you watch on back? Like, I'm risk. Thank you. That's what the old people do. Uh, what the fuck? Hey, you ever hold a woman? I paid already. Yeah, no, you. I need to pass. Don't worry about just... it. Okay. Yeah. Like Since like when? He says just look down in it instead of having to turn your wrist. Just look down. Because yeah. your wrist isn't facing inwards, is it? Oh. Is Dragon coming? Down. I think we're all here now. Did oh, anyone get a hold of Dragon? Break yeah, I talked to him in earlier. What do you want to break? Is, is he I kind of you said, kind of just like you just like you bugging. He might have actually now that no. I think about it, he might have crashed. Because okay. he said, "Oh shit, okay," rifle, and then the phone hung up. Oh. And then. That makes sense. There you. You coming? Oh okay. All right, we'll just we'll run this one and then we'll probably put another one up before the end of the storm. Well, yeah, of course I haven't been in the military. I have no need to be in the military. Thanks, see you soon. I mean, right, he ended up in the arcade before this, so... Okay. So the question is, do you guys want to wait for people from the other race to join, or do you just want to go? Fuck them. I, I don't care. Just yeah. Alright, they just We finished. have too many without yeah. phasing, it's bullshit anyways. Wait, aren't we missing one person? They'll go down. Oh, that's, oh yeah, Dante. Uh, that's Dante. Okay. Yeah, he should be here soon. They're all joining now. <laughs> no, I'm not changing. People are gonna have to deal with it. Oh, you're here? Oh, yeah, you're there. You are. Yeah, yeah, you're right there. Okay. I wasn't looking that way. I'm sorry. <laughs> all right. What was your idea, by the way? Uh, remember how you told me you were your throat was hurting yesterday? Um. Having to explain shit all the fucking time. Uh, yeah. I was thinking, if you wanted, um, I could probably set it up to where I can get like a. Uh, I swear this is gonna sound a camera. Uh, I can just no, throw some earmuffs no, so no, I don't no, hear no. anything. No, it's fine. I'm just telling a shorter story. Oh, that's all. That's all I. That's all I can do. Go ahead and pay Yasuzumi if you have any. Yeah, I'm getting changed. One sec. Oh wait, I don't. What? I don't. Live, I don't have an apartment here anymore. Fuck! I'm gonna change. Yeah, I can't help you here. I don't live here either. So drunk. Thank you. Yeah. Wanna get on the public race train together? Then? That's yeah, the Viper. Yeah. You see the Viper? It's no string. Yeah, I'm. That's... Does someone want to post? What is? What is it? The public one? Let's see. I'll do. I'll do. It's like nine one point one... five. Yeah. Huh? Oh fuck. 
I'm just doing the no strings attached. Oh. I need hey, to right sound fucked up. Back. Sorry, say that again. Do I sound fucked up? Like, uh, like a robot? Radio, radio. No, you're good. Oh, thank what? fuck. Oh my god, it's been like days. Okay, alright, I'm, I'm pulling up. I just had to okay. make sure before I can... can still see the wing. Okay. Before I show up. Okay. Yeah. I, I can still though. see the We've... big no, fat no, wing. Right. This viper's been running from us every time we see it, so... Where'd it go? It's right, right over there. it, like, you right, see the yeah. Right, yeah, if you, if you look east, you can see the wing <laughs> over the bush. Big wang gang. Be cool. Look, Mr. Stranger, I don't mind the strong and silent type, but you're gonna have to pay up though. Thank you. No, no. Ah, be cool, man. <laughs> All right. Do you want to put a hard limit on this, or like just like starting in three or something, and whoever's here is here? I think we're actually all here, potentially. Ooh. Unless even more people joined. Yeah, no, we're uh, all here. Uh, oh, no, no, wait, wait. Okay, yeah. Healthy and no strings. That's the other one. Alright, hand me a thousand and we're good to go. Yep. Alright. Wait, for real? Excuse me. Might as well. Hold on, I need more vibes for this. Uh, Here. who's host? Here. Here. Are you host? You think I have time to get up? Uh, the Viper is... No. No, shit. okay, I'll yeah, just uh, sorry, join sorry. the next one. Yeah, that's no, okay. <laughs> Alright, remember everyone, 60 seconds and then full contact, okay? 60 seconds. Toby's not gonna know the track. <laughs> no. You and your fat ass slowing my car down. Hey, my ass ain't fat, it's just... Yeah, it's round, right, bullshit. Contacts, be careful.
Big Rock Way again. Fuck. See you. Got a C7 Corvette trying to take out for the Viper. Oh, really? Alright. I would say that we would go to help it, but the thing doesn't need much help, I'll be honest with you. Yeah, it's already gone. I think it's gonna try to chase it. Sorry. C7 attached to anyone else? 
Uh, it was attached to me for a little bit, but it, uh, I don't know what street it is, but it's on that street that's like just uh, east of like uh, autos. I've seen PPIs, but that's it. Local was a very inconvenience. Cops chasing something around Alta. Yeah, old Benny's. They're going south. Yeah. Put it in the white escort. So that's some long radio. Is that fucking Henry with no radio? Ah, sorry. Yeah, he has his own radio. Okay. I was just not paying attention because I have. Music very loud and Chase is crying in the back of my car. You're not getting Chase, are you? But I'm chilling. No, it's unrelated. Yeah, it's like crossing the race, not on the track. Oh, okay. Goodness. 25? Hey, yo! Alright! What the hell? That was with the shittest start, too. Okay. Damn. There are a couple of cops around MPD. Might be too good at this track. It is a bit of cheating, I guess. I drove by cops like 17 times and nothing. Yeah, they didn't give a fuck. I had a, I had a cop hit on. Oh. And nothing? This is a CV pie. Uh, okay. 
told them I'm sorry because I was. Mm. Where are you though? Yeah, just not enough to stick around. <laughs> yeah. Holy fuck, my car was fucked up. That was could have been bad. Interesting. Thank you. No? Thank you, thank you. What track do you guys want to do? Multi shot <laughs> long race. Or oh, multi race long shot. Serious oh, suggestions know. only. Oh, then never mind. Break that local, dude. <laughs> uh. Brokey alert? They're gonna do sneaky link. Fuck There's so many people. What the? Excuse me. Fuck Brokey alert. I think we should do Brokey alert for like the last 30 minutes of the storm. 100 laps, 100 laps. I don't even know how long it takes to do that track. Uh, what about guillotine? Or hangover hills or something? Yeah, the question control. is do we join them or do we do our own thing? Uh, um, what, what, what are they doing? Sneaky Link? I don't care, honestly. I'm track. done for whatever. What are, what are these new tracks, by the way? I've never done this track. Sneaky Link and Hidden Gem. What's up with that? Who's law? I could call them and ask if they got time to wait for us. Does anyone know? Mm, could it be Liam? Law? Oh, it might be. I have no idea, just like, that that's the first thing that came to my mind. Hello. Is that you hosting? Yeah. Do you have time for us to come to your race? We're just yeah, finished. Yeah, you guys can come. Alright, sounds good. Right. I'll see you there. Bye-bye. I need to refuel what's Alright, yeah, we can uh, we can get over there. As long as we go right, All right. now. Where yeah, I'll refuel real quick and I'll be on the uh, I'll be there. It starts on Hawick or Spanish, oh, I think. One yeah, it starts right up the road. Just gonna get gas. I'm gonna top up gas and pull real quick. I've never done Sneaky Link. I'm pregnant. 776, hey. Oh, congratulations. Thank you so much. What? Pregnant with what? A heart stopper? No, Amar. Amar has carried like 50 of my children. I just wanted to carry one to just share them. Oh. That's yeah. thoughtful oh, of you. You're, you're that, you're, I, I respect that. Yeah, you're, 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 so sharing the, you're sharing the burden. Thank you. 
course. Yeah, you, you should you should you should straighten up though, otherwise your back is gonna kill you. Yeah, oh, you it's okay. Gonna... I got yeah. gotta got a good arch. Is there any others coming? Uh, uh, probably yeah. Okay. Yeah, a couple more probably. There's a yeah. Oh, there's oh, a pink thing. thirty-four coming, I think. Seven seven six. Yeah. Please, thank you so much. Thank you. You're you're a darling. You on the way, uh, Dildo Dan? Yeah. Okay, I'm here. coming. Oh. There is. Uh, PayPal seven seven six. I think so. Is there a radio? Seven seven six. No, it was just down the one we're on. Thank you so much. What are you doing? Okay, hang on, let me. <laughs> Did the angel just like make a bunch of tracks? First time on this track, be nice everyone. Ah! Oh, I wasn't in the fuck. What? Oh no. I swear to God, I was in the race. <laughs> I'm not in it, but I'm on standby for anyone who needs it. How many people from our fucking crew can get to the fucking Oh shit, I thought we were... Oops. Hey, don't kill me, we're in 11. Please, okay? <laughs> Stalled me. Crash gun stall, the absolute classic.
Uff. No, dude. Ah, bogging. That's not worth it anyway. The local comes around the corner just as the game lags. It's just GG. No re Can't do anything at that point. Like my input gets eaten when uh, you do that. If we just full summit for the record. Yeah, put the tires on the cut. Big brain. The race got to do checkpoint like 28. Not a race fucking road, jeez. when people cuss trucks. That checkpoint looks like he didn't even know about the cut <laughs> and it's just like placed randomly. Like he didn't even think about the cut, I don't think. If that's his stance. Slap is garbage. Like, how are you supposed to, like, react to what the fuck I'm seeing right now? You fuck off, fucking piece of shit, fucking local garbage, fucking inbred mongoloid. Holy fuck.
Okay. <laughs> and I'm bogging again. How do you go from no engine light to bogging by hitting a trash can? Ugh. There's still like 15 minutes. That's 15 minutes you can get caught on. So I'm not, I'm not, I'm not risking this shit, bro. That shit was pure AIDS. It's not the line I meant to take, I kind of just had to take it. That sucked. I mean, I feel like... I don't know. Was that my fault? What happened there? I feel like I could... A lot of that I didn't even have control over. I have quite some stutters today. Yeah, welcome to NoPixel. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, bro. Oh. the track it looks interesting from the preview it's actually pretty good there's like one crossover section which annoys me but it, the, the crossover is close enough that you can only really do it to phasing reliably yeah it's the, really close so like if you're just a little bit ahead or behind of someone then there's a chance you'll crash Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. Preference like that little uh, run down, I think, hot courthouse. It goes like, there's like a small circle you have to go through around there. Through the hospital part of the drive? Yeah. Yeah. for bro killer yeah <laughs> well that sucked I 
I'm gonna try that track by two laps more. Just to see. Yeah, go go do that. Classic. Who's R34 at the house? No, never mind, no. It's the plate is speech. Like I don't, I don't know how to pronounce that honestly. Really? Really, bro? Fuck off! I'm so tired of this, bro. Oh, let me just teleport to the next intersection. <laughs> right on your line. Fuck you. A man. Okay, <laughs> yeah, sure. Yep, local on Apex. Yep, sliding out for no reason. Man, this is peak.
that rev stall was so bad. Fuck me. It's Jover, bro. Did you miss? Just a lot of talking, people like recapping what's happening. Also, Rachel, thank you so much for getting to Tranquility. I missed it a little bit. Thank you. Yes. Come on. Oh. oh my, bro. Why? I'm not gonna have time to repair now. I'm not gonna have time to repair now. Bro. <laughs> Fucking repair, you troglodytes! The longest repairs in the history of mankind. Come on, give me right side of the ring. No. Nope. Maybe right side of the ring this time? No. Nope. I'm not even gonna make that one. That's it. What?
He wasn't even expecting that himself. He kept shooting. Was that was it bones? Wait, what did I miss? I think I'm stupid. Is she in the trunk? What did they even explode on? What is there to explode on there? Oh, this thing? <laughs> You guys see this one? <laughs> you didn't aim, so he threw it at his feet. I don't see that clip here. Oh, here. <laughs> I have a I have a question question chat. This officer right here is this gro like gro like negli negligence with a gun use. How close is Mr. K to being literally fired upon? 
Like, what's even the right thing to do in this situation? Dude, this is so good. <laughs> He's getting fucking Omega trolled, bro. One moment. Yeah, it's not happening, so it's okay. Sorry about that. All right, well, me, it's okay. Well, maybe next time will be better. How bad is that? It's bad. It's okay. Anyway, I'm gonna... I'm gonna head out then. Is there anyone streaming? That we can host? Or a raid, whatever it's called? Uh, 
Sure, let's read this now. Thanks for watching, everyone. Sorry about the cute... Apologies.